carbon cano lab is an environmental NPO managing the largest solar PV system capacity in Hong Kong. We have constructed 34 solar energy sites comprising 5,000 solar panels with a total capacity of more than 24,000 kilowatts. This capacity is equivalent to avoiding more than 1,000 tons of CO2 emissions. The energy produced by these sites will be utilized to power the energy requirements of Hong Kong citizens. Up to 2020, Asia-Pacific region's renewable energy mix accounted for 24.46%. Looking into Hong Kong's performance, the renewable energy mix accounts for only 0.1%. Carbon Care InnoLab initiated an innovative scheme called the Solar Care Program to demonstrate and inspire the community to a collaborative effort to accelerating the renewable energy supply. This program consists of matching philanthropy funding, system installation and maintenance. The solar care system not only generates renewable energy, but also stimulates the NPOs to introduce climate change education into their services. Through the partners, the message is reaching the young, the elderly, and the marginal communities that they support. The solar care program aligns with SDG 7, 11, 13, and 17. The solar care program adopts a community-based approach. Achieving carbon neutrality is possible if it involves all stakeholders. One of the key things that we, we do is, is um, teach them about environmental responsibility. And if we can um, role model that for them, then I think that they leave better understanding what can be done uh, and the way that society should be heading. We're an experiential education organisation, which means that we teach uh, or the students learn through doing and through seeing uh, and so the, the solar panels really allow our participants to see firsthand what can be done. Um, we actually measure the outcomes for our participants and our scores in environmental responsibility, in other words after the course, uh, the, the extent to which young people have increased their awareness of the environment are very, very high, which shows that we, we really make a difference on participants' environmental understanding and responsibility. Outward Bound was affected massively by the pandemic, the same as everybody. We haven't really didn't operate for three years, which meant no income. And although that's not the aim of the, of the feed-in tariff, obviously it did help us massively uh, survive those really challenging times. The other thing that it really allows us to do is to um, be a little bit more proactive in other environmental areas so we can choose more environmentally friendly options because even though they may be more expensive because we are able to to offset it with some of the feed-in tariff costs so it allows us to walk the walk a little bit more. We have signed up to the Outward Bound International Environmental Charter and in order to do that we need to commit to uh, environmentally friendly supply chains, uh, environmentally responsible operations for example, and the feed-in tariff has allowed us to, to really commit to that fully. Crossroads cares deeply about the poor and it is the poor who are the most affected by the impacts of climate change from increased weather events, extreme weather events like droughts and floods. It's crucial to us that we not only use sustainable energy ourselves, but inspire others to do likewise so we can reduce climate effects and help the poor as a result. The solar care program is a win-win-win for Crossroads. It provides us with income through the feed-in tariff scheme up to two to three percent of our annual budget, which means that translates into helping thousands of people in Hong Kong. We send goods like clothes, and furnishings and electrical appliances to people here in Hong Kong and all around the world. And that money is the equivalent of us helping about 1,600 people in Hong Kong alone just because of the power of the sun. Our solar installation not only brings in money that we can use to operate our services, helping people in Hong Kong and around the world, but it also helps us inspire thousands of students and other members of the community to think about what it would mean to have sustainable energy throughout Hong Kong and throughout the world. It helps us show people 
how energy, particularly solar, can make a difference in developing nations where people don't even have access to regular energy for their daily needs. By the year of 2030, the Solar Care Programme will partner up and install solar PV systems for 70 sites. The total projected capacity of these systems will be more than 4.7 million kilowatts, generating approximately 2.4 million kilowatts of energy per month. This amount of energy will be sufficient to power approximately 18,000 households on a monthly basis. Carbon Care and Olab also nurtures and expands the active community for climate just transition and devocalization. Our focus is to prioritize the protection and respect of vulnerable communities, both locally and globally.